What's up my Notches? This is Notches Cooks and today we're talking about cooking and our favorite foods. My name is Jackson and this is Amari. And we're with Notches Cooks of Miss Hobson's fifth grade broadcast journalism class. My Amar <laughs> Amari? What's your favorite food? My favorite food is chicken strips, but I like to put salt on them because I don't eat like sauce a lot, and so I get um, fries with it too. And then I like to have like a dark soda as a drink because I don't really like fruity stuff anymore like that. My favorite food is um, burgers. Burgers are good. Now we're gonna go to Natalia. She's gonna talk to. People see sound and roaming the hallway about their favorite foods. We like to thank all of our people that we interviewed too. Thank you for your time and putting up with us. Bye. Good job, Natalia, too. <laughs> Bye. That was awkward. As you just came out of that disgusting bathroom. We want to ask you something. We want to know what's your favorite food. My favorite food, um, I probably got it with steak. I mean, you can't really go wrong with it. Get it cooked medium rare. You already know what it is. Okay. All right. Yeah. yeah, that's about it. Oh, oh, we forgot. Uh, <laughs> your name, please. Yeah, my name is Caden Holly, uh, senior at Bel Air High School. Um, that's me, guys. What's your name? Melanie. Okay, what's your favorite food? Pizza. Okay, what kind of pizza? Pepperoni. Okay. Anything else, like a side or anything? Onions. Onions. That's different. Okay, thank you, Melanie. Uh, what's your name first? Javion. Okay, thank you, Mr. Javion. We want to know, uh, what's your favorite food? Uh, nachos. Nachos. With queso? Nah. Just chips? Yeah. <laughs> Hi, this is Jackson and Aaron from Knowledge Cooks. Today we're going to be baking some <laughs> stuff. <laughs> First, we're going to coat the pizza dish. I mean, cameraman, getting closer. First, we're going to coat the pizza dish with flour. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, there. <laughs> Jackson, Jackson, help me, Jackson. No. <laughs> then, we're going to. Oh. <laughs> okay. We're going to break the counter. We're gonna, we're going to pop open the, uh... Give me it, you fool. Wait, wait, wait. Give me it. I've got it, I've got it. Wonderful. Now we have the pizza dough. Look at all that dough. Need a rolling pin. Actually, this particular dough we got from Randall's. Sponsored by Randall's. Is able to be unrolled naturally, I believe, if I could find the, uh, the seam. Whatever the heck it is. I, I need to make something clear. We are not officially sponsored by Randall's. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So it seems that we're having a difficulty, and uh, there's no way in heck I'm finding this. Uh, we need a rolling pin. Shh. That's not right. Shh. It's really not, but I'm... That's... Wait a this is wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I can't. I'm not. I'm, I can't. Aaron, it make needs dough flour. From scratch. I can't make dough from Aaron, scratch. it needs I'm flour. Do no. Yes. Okay, Jackson, you do it. You were supposed to unroll it. Yeah, we were supposed to, but I couldn't find the seam. I couldn't get it. <gasps> oh, God. Aaron's a smart one. What are you doing? It's been an Aaron. So far as the, uh, the yeah. original crust pizza. I'm not going to say what that actually looks like. That we've unrolled? Oh, no. Oh no, it's all going so wrong so fast. And as you can see, he is not doing very well. The cooking show was canceled one month into, into. I say I did this all by myself. Wash my hands. Stop filming. <laughs> <laughs> and so after a quick 10-15 minutes, we completely the butchered the pizza. And then reformed it into something that looks vaguely like a pizza.
Wonderful. Next, we'll put it into the oven that's done preheating. Okay. Uh, the eight minute, oh, baking period is, pre-baking period is That's done. supposed to happen. I'm not sure. It's supposed to happen. That's, baking, it rise. Sure. It would rise. Is it supposed to rise? It's not actual dough. Well, <clears throat> I think it's because we put so much flour on it. Okay, now it's time to put on the top. So we, we pressed the rising bubble down. Now we're going to add pizza sauce. The cheeses. Get the get cheeses. The cheese. Get the cheese, boy. I better get the cheese then. Salami. Ten minutes are up. We're gonna take the pizza out and see how it came out. Looks like it rose again. It's fine. It's fine. So now we're going to cut the pizza. Looking yeah, that's, good. That's even. All right, do one more, please. That's, yep. that's not even. Smart one. That's all right. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, finish. Yeah. Cool. All right. All right. All right. We'll taste it shortly. Hello. Welcome back. This is not good. <laughs> this was the result of our pizza. We're going to be testing it. Soon. That was a Jackson. <laughs> Jackson, is it is it any good? Yeah. Okay. Caitlin, how have you liked your pizza? Is it oh, good? Oh, wow! Well, one of them. Very good. What? Horrible. Is it really bad? No, it's It's good. Yeah. You like it? Yeah. Awesome. Thank you, Caitlin. And so, Jackson and I have both finished our plates for the most part. <laughs> it was a great pizza. Caitlin enjoyed it too. This has been Nausea Cooks. Thank you for joining us to make pizza. Peace out. Hi, my name is Amari. And I'm Aaron. This has been Nausea Cooks with Miss Hobson's fifth period broadcasting journalism class. We want to thank everyone from um, our interviews for letting us interview them. And yeah, bye. <laughs>